Okay guys, Roger here again, and I found a different puddle at Kettle Creek which has a number of clumps of spotted salamander eggs. Now they're under the water and they haven't hatched yet. They're going to take a little bit longer than the wood frogs. But if you take a look, you can see they look like white clumps of jelly. And you don't really see anything inside of them. But if I take you down under the water, you should be able to see little black dots, which are the baby salamanders. are going to eventually develop into bigger salamanders, but we need a little bit warmer weather. And out here at this vernal pool, the sun shines bright so the salamander eggs will warm up and they'll hatch into baby salamanders. Once they hatch out, those baby salamanders will live in this puddle for a few weeks and then they'll go up in the forest and spend the rest of their life under logs and rocks. And as I was looking at these, I noticed a clump of wood frog eggs that did not hatch yet. Take a look at these guys. These, salam these tadpoles are still in their clump. You can see they look like tadpoles. They're moving and wiggling a little bit, but they need a few more days of warm weather before they start coming out and hatching. Let's see if I can get a closer look under the water. Pretty cool, right? And those eggs were all laid by one wood frog so they can produce a lot of tadpoles. Okay, we're gonna leave this vernal pool behind and we'll come back in a week or two as it warms up and see what else we can find. Maybe some toads and spring peeper eggs. Hey, this is Roger from Kettle Creek signing off and I hope you have a chance to get outside and look in puddles or at the edge of ponds and lakes for those amphibian eggs. Very important though, kids, don't take them out of the water because no matter how much we wanna take them home and put them in an aquarium, they're not going to hatch nearly as well. Leave them out where you find them. Don't break them apart. And just check in on them once in a while. Once in a while. And you can see as those tadpoles hatch out and get bigger and bigger on their way to turning into frogs and salamanders. Okay, that's Roger signing off. Mm -hmm.